in this particular problem, two blocks are initially at rest. Their masses are M1 and M2. They are connected by a spring having spring constant K. Now block of mass M1 is pulled by a force F1 and M2 is pulled by a force F2. Now we need to find maximum elongation of the spring. So let us first find out the acceleration of center of mass. Acceleration of center of mass is net force F1 minus F2 by net mass M1 plus M2. This is the acceleration of center of mass. Now if we consider acceleration of each block, if F1 is force on it, F is the force due to spring during the elongation, M1 is mass and its acceleration is ACM. So here from we can write F1 minus F2 be equal to M1 into ACM. That is, here from we can write F2 be equal to F1 minus M1 ACM or F1 minus M1 into F1 minus F2 by M1 plus M2. This can be simplified as M1 F1 plus M2 F1 minus M1 F1 plus M1 F2 by M1 plus M2. M1 F1 and minus M1 F1 is cancelled and force applied by spring on the block is M1 F2 plus M2 F1 by M1 plus M2. If due to this force spring is elongated by a distance x by length x then energy stored in the spring half kx square that is equal to f into x or x the elongation is 2f by k. So if I put the value of f then x comes out to be twice of m1 f2 plus m2 f1 by k into m1 plus m2 this is the maximum elongation of the spring.